is up what is up what is up thank you for dropping in stopping in saying hello i just want to show you real quick how to apply our magnetic lashes and just gonna put on some lippy i know the majority of the people who watch and follow me they're not a full face makeup wearer so i just want to remind you that you can still look gorgeous and amazing with our lashes even though you don't do a full face so come on in have a seat uh if you have your lashes pull them out follow along with me make sure you tag somebody or share this with anybody who may be interested in our amazing lashes so we're gonna go ahead and get started i don't want to keep you long today i am belinda little i am an associate affiliate of tori bell cosmetics and we are number one the originals when it comes to the magnetic liner so if anybody is going to be the best it is going to be us so go ahead and woke up wash my face put on moisturizer that is it wash my face put on moisturizer and that's a it i gotta make a couple of runs so i'm like i am not leaving this house because i don't have my lashes on so just gonna be real quick with it i always start out with some type of primer and we do have a pore perfecting primer that we use because my skin is oily so i want to make sure that i absorb some of that oil even though i'm not doing a lot to it also when you're doing your lashes if you have hooded lids or oily lids you're going to want to put on some type of primer some type of um, foundation eyeshadow or something to absorb your um, oil on your eyes so we're going to go ahead and do this so i just put some primer on put some above my eyelids because I want to absorb the oil in my skin. I'm not putting on any foundation, any powder, nothing. That's it. This is what you get. This is me and my full glory. So I just put on some primer, our pore perfecting, our pore perfecting primer is what I used. So that's all I did so far. I'm going to go ahead and put on our Ignite Plumping Lip Gloss. I love this lip gloss. It is, um, it has hydrochloric, you know what, don't let me get the line, but it has something in here that's going to pull the moisture and make your lips a little bit more plump. So, uh, our lippies are a matte color and I'm, I, I like a more of a gloss. So I usually do the Ignite Lip Plump, Lip Plumper to give my lips more pout or our 24 karat gold. So go ahead and put this on so that my lips can be moist and start getting plump so that's that and then the longer it stays on it just starts falling you know getting fuller so now we're gonna go ahead and get started all we're doing is like, oh one we can't forget eyebrows i'm sorry i forgot to mention that we're gonna do a little we're just gonna fill my eyebrows in just a little bit we're not gonna do a full out you know brow tutorial i'm just gonna fill in right here um where it's lighter so i'm just gonna do that and i i do have to look in my mirror and not the camera but i hope you guys can see that but our Brow gel is waterproof, smudge proof. It is amazing. It comes in dark brown, brown, black, taupe, dark brown, brown, taupe, and black. Four different colors. So uh, I usually do the dark brown and I use the black when I'm using it as a liner on my eyes. Because like I said, it is waterproof and lasts all day. Hey, Deja. Hey, Laquita. How are you? Thanks for sharing, girl. Thank you. I appreciate it. So I'm just filling in my brows because I like to, you know, make sure they're clean. So that's it. You see how quick that was? That took like, what, a minute, if that. 
So now let's get to these lashes. I always start out with a nice base of mascara. Our Cyrene Mascara 4D Lengthening um, Fiber Mascara One Step. This is what I use. This is my mascara that I love. When I'm going without lashes, I make sure I have this on because it gives me length. Uh, if you know this now, like, um, let me turn to the side. Maybe you can see right there my, how my lashes are right there. So this is going to give me some length and it helps to blend my lash, my natural lash with our lashes. So Go ahead and go ahead and put this on. And like I said, I'm looking in my mirror to the left. So if I'm not looking right at you, please forgive me for a moment. I don't want to have mascara all over my face. So, and I just do, when I'm doing lashes, I just usually do one coat. But if you're going without lashes and you just want mascara, Add as many coats as you like because the more coats you add, that fiber just keeps adding to it and keeps adding to the length. So let me see if I can turn to the side, get in that white part. You see how now I have a little bit more length than I did before. That is our Siren 4D mascara. Let me go ahead and do the other eye. Okay, lashes are done. Today we are going to put on Ladies Night. Ladies Night was my first ever. Let me see if I can. Okay, there we go. My first ever magnetic lash when I joined this business. It is a cat eye, meaning it is short on the inside and it gets longer as you go out. It has a crisscross pattern. So I, I really love this lash. It also comes with 10 anchors. Uh, one, I actually dropped it the other day. Uh, <laughs> so yeah, but it comes with 10. And these are our more powerful 10 one millimeter magnets. These are the bomb. Ladies Night is my first love and will always be my favorite. So we're going to do USA liner, made in the USA liner, the only magnetic liner that is made in the USA. You want to shake it up real good. Shake, shake, shake. You can not shake it too much. It's, you know, so we're going to shake it up real good. And when I shake it up, I like to also stir it around. Do not pump because when you pump, you're putting air in there and that, um, messes it up. We don't want to do that. And when you take it out, you pull straight out. You don't want to wipe it on the sides. If you need to wipe it, just go ahead and wipe it on some tissue, your hand or whatever, but don't wipe it on the, on the sides. So just pull it straight out like that. This is the Made in the USA liner. It is water uh, resistant. It is not waterproof like our classic. It is water resistant so um you can still sweat and do that kind of stuff with it uh you go to the gym you may have to after you work out uh you should be still good to go but if not just apply a little bit more in those probably your corners that kind of thing but it is water resistant so we're going to go ahead and put it on so let me scoot up close so you guys can see and i'm going to See if I can zoom in a little bit. Okay, zoom in a little bit and I'm gonna be looking at my mirror. When I do this, I try and get as close to my lashes as possible. Do not be afraid. Do not be afraid to get them on your lash, okay? Because with our makeup remover, our Shake It Off remover, it is oil-based. Or if you don't have our Shake It Off remover and you have an oil-based remover, use that. So uh, at the end of the night when you're removing your lashes, do not be afraid to get this on your lash because we want this lash to be as close as possible to your natural lashes to look just a little bit more natural. So, 
put that in and we're gonna do the other eye. Here we go, we're gonna put a second coat on. And once we put our second cut on, we're gonna to need to let that dry for two minutes. Make sure, like I said, you get that inside and that outside. I didn't go. That's what you said. Yes, the, the the inside and the out the inside corner and the outside corner is where you want to pay extra attention to because that's where like when we're doing it, that's where it kind of fades out. So even if like I've already done my second coat, if I want to go back in and just kind of focus on that area and put just a little bit more on that inside in the outside corner. If you're having problems with it lifting after you've applied that inside and the outside, you may want to check your lash to make sure it's not too long. And because you are able to trim our lashes, that's the great part about them is because they have 10 one millimeter magnets uh, on the inside you can trim them one magnet at a time until you get the length that you need. You don't want to start off trimming them. Put them on, wear them, see how they feel. If they're lifting or if you're feeling that lash as you blink in here, then you probably need to cut one magnet off and, you know, just kind of scoot it over a little bit. So we're going to let this dry. Have my little handy dandy fan to speed things up. But you want to let this dry for at least two minutes because the thing is you want this to apply to your lash because of the magnets and not because of the sticky, tacky wetness of it. So, going to let that dry. And while we're letting that dry, I'm going to go ahead and put on my lippy. This is our TB Red. It is long lasting. It um, lasts all day. I put this on before and even though I'm on and off with my mask by the end of the day I still have on TB red or whichever lippy I'm wearing that day so we're gonna do TB red because it's my favorite and we're gonna just do this And there's the TB Red. Uh, I have the Ignite Lip Plumper underneath. So yes, it will come off because I put gloss on it. So um, it is gonna come off. But even though I have the Lip Plumper gloss on and I put the TB Red on top, even with my mask, yeah, it's gonna come off in my mask some because I have on the gloss. But I'm still going to have on lipstick at the end of the day. Our lipstick is amazing and we have so many great colors coming out it's kind of exciting so we have that and let me see I, I like to feel this to see if it's dry before I apply my lash remember I'm applying ladies night my first love the very first lash that I had when I came into the business it is a cat eye meaning short in the inside longer on the outside these are our anchors you can apply our lashes with anchors only and I've done some videos before and of course you know I'll do it again so that everybody knows how to do it when you first get our lashes and I've only worn these a couple of times so when you first get our lashes make sure you, I call it slinky. You want to make them more pliable. So what you want to do is just kind of slinky them, bend them. This makes it to where it's going to shape your lid so much better. Try and bend in between each of those magnets. And then just kind of slinky.
like that. See how much, how much more curved that is? That's going to fit the shape of my eye so much better. So here we go. I think you guys can see and it automatically, that magnet, if you see that pull, that's just one magnet on that liner. This is not trick camera. So that is just that one magnet uh, adhering to this magnetic liner. I try and get my lashes as close to my natural lashes as possible. That's why I don't mind getting liner on my lash. I try and almost sit it on there. And then after I sit it on there, I go through and I squeeze outside, middle, and then inside just to make sure it is where it's supposed to be. That is ladies night. Remember, I have on no other makeup. I'm just doing lashes, lippy, and I cheated and did my brow. So here, you see how straight this is? That is pretty straight. So we're going to take that off and we're going to slinky it. Like so. Make sure you're bending in between each of those magnets so that it will just fit to your eye as flush as possible. Just slinky it one more time, you see? Look at that curve. That's just gonna really sit on that lid really well. And then, just like before, we're gonna just go inside Like so, y'all see that? That is not a magic trick. That is our powerful magnet. And then I just sit it down. And then pinch. These babies aren't going anywhere. This is ladies night. That cat eye look. Let me turn to the side. It's amazing what lashes can do. Don't get me wrong, I was cute before, but these lashes just kind of bring it out. It just bring it out. It just brings it out. <laughs> Thank you. So this is ladies night. And if you want, ladies night to me, it because many people they look at some of our lashes like wonder lash day night and ladies night and they just think oh no that's too long that's too much it's not it's perfect especially if you're going to be in front of a camera like zoom or taking photos or just anything <laughs> right <laughs> right now i'm a baddie <laughs> But if you're going to be taking photos in front of a camera, in front of a Zoom, in front of an audience, you're going to want a lash that demands a little bit of attention. So you're going to want to look for our ladies night, our wonder lash, or our date night. The length to me is perfect. They have a little bit more fullness. Ladies night is more of the cat eye. So if you have your eyes are shaped kind of like mine, kind of downward turn. That cat eye brings out your eyes just a little bit more. So this is probably why it's my favorite lash. But I also love Selfie. Selfie is also a cat eye lash, and I love Selfie. And you can take our lashes if you have more than one, and you can stack them. So, you know, let's say I'm at work, and this ladies' night, it's perfect for daytime office wear, but then I'm going out at night and I want a little bit more pop. Yeah, I can take these off and change lashes, but I can also stack a lash on top and have a whole different look. So let me see. What are we going to stack on top? Um, let's see. I'm always disappearing in the camera. Let me stack this selfie. I'm gonna stack this selfie on top. I love because selfie is also a cat eye. 
Now, normally I would put selfie at the bottom because it's longer, but it is not going to hurt a soul if I, that's not a selfie. It is not going to hurt a soul if I put selfie on top of ladies night. You can do what you want with your lashes. Trust me, these are your lashes, girl. Do what you want. So this is Selfie. I'm going to show you Selfie before I put it on. That's Selfie. It is also... Uh, where's my applicator? Yes, yeah, Selfie and Wonder Lash is nice, too. It really is. Okay, so this is Selfie. Also a cat eye. Short on the inside, longer on the outside. So just like your ladies night. So the shortness goes on the inside. And so I'm gonna stack. And you can use our applicator or you can use our finger. And because it's magnetic, it just simply sits right on top of the other one. So if you need a little bit more length, you can always stack. Or a little bit more fullness, you can always stack. So. You see how that one is just a little bit more fuller because it's two lashes and that as opposed to that one. And go ahead and pull out my other selfie. And we just stack that right on top of ladies night. Two of my favorite lashes. I don't know in which order. I would say selfie first, then ladies night, or they're close first and second, but these two are my favorite lashes. Um, this is ladies night on the bottom, selfie on top with our Made in the USA liner. So that's that. So if you just want to put on lashes and go, you truly can. You do not have to be a full face wearer. You can just do a uh, makeup wearer. You can just, just do your lashes, your lippy, and your brows if you want, and head out the door in five minutes or less and still be beautiful and amazing. All our lashes do is just help the, the, the naturally radiant. It helps your face shine through what you love about your face. It just brings it out. You are already beautiful. It just brings it out. That's it. So, if you have any questions about these lashes, how to apply them, how to order, or anything like this, if an affiliate shared this with you, get back with them. If uh, you're one of my followers or customers or anything like that, potential customers, go ahead and comment or message me, and I'll give you all the information you need on these magnetic lashes, the lippy, or even the brow gel, if you're interested, or the pore perfector cream. We have so much! We're so much more than lashes, guys. So, until next time, everybody, thank you for tuning in. I truly appreciate it. Enjoy the rest of your day. And